What's up, everybody? Welcome back to Kingdom Hearts D&D. As always, I'm your host, Connor. With us, we have Mike as Shinji. You, you. Travis as Graham. Hey. And supposedly, Zach is rising. will be joining in like a half hour. It's, it's a bit of a toss-up. Maybe it won't happen. Remember in Naruto D&D when this happened with Nick? All right, so let's continue. Quick recap as to what happened last time. Graham fought Marcus and bested him in a one-on-one -on -one battle. Then the team was forced to retreat as their world fell to darkness. The team then learned a bit about Tenem and Lumen back at Crossroads before unlock unlocking the next and final path. All right, so y'all hopped in the gummy ship and you flew to the universe. Let's hear those, uh, those armor tokens there. Boom, 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 All right. boom, 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 boom. Bum, 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 bum. All right, and uh, so so where y'all going? Uh, yeah. we got some money now. We can we can go restock a little bit. Yeah, you free to stop by the city dreams if you wish. Let me back out just to make sure Connor's not messing with us. So where y'all going? Big dark area on the map that looks weird. <laughs> Nowhere? <laughs> Nowhere in particular? Yeah, I know a fun fact as well. That there's nothing that was hinted for in a previous episode. It was just something I did on the side. Uh, you know when you chose to fight the tournament before going to Graham's World? Yeah. Uh, if you had gone to Graham's World instead, the world wouldn't have naturally fallen to darkness. You could have tried to prevent Malice from forcing it to. Nah, I, I like our odds better in the tournament. <laughs> I think it was a funner path in the end, either way. <laughs> All right. That's what I thought I had. <laughs> Only got 760, though. I thought about that. I also thought about, like, I wonder if Connor made this fight a lot easier because Zach's not here. So he made the other two people leave. Or I was, then I was like, or was this like the whole <laughs> the plan the whole time? It was pretty much the plan the whole time. Um, but I wasn't sure if you'd do it the first turn. If you'd summon uh, Silas. Hmm. Um, there were a couple of changes I did make to Marcus, but there were, that was just like reducing some DCs since it was a one-on-one. -on -one. Hmm. Oh, snap. Now recording. Hey. Hey. Oh, is he here? Yeah. yeah. Hello. Hello. How's While the child? You... He's eating, but he's good. Well, he's getting set up, let's go buy our stuff, Shinji. Yeah, go buy... Here. Yeah, let's go buy two from the Moogle. Hey, Mr. Moogle, can we buy two um, magic... A uh, magic boosts? Sure, that's going to cost you 40,000 money. With, uh, I got synthesis material. Oh, so you want to synthesize them, not buy them. Okay. Thank you. Koopa. <clears throat> well, uh, here you are, Koopa. This Moogle getting fresh with us. <laughs> Who do you think you are? Hey, he said he wanted to buy one. I had to clarify. <laughs> <laughs> I want to take your get... manager. The day of Moogle. <laughs> <laughs> I can't correct it by a Moogle. You can't speak to me like that. I fought in the war, Koopa. Right. Your manager. There you Great go. Moogle versus Thank Chocobo you. War. No problem, buddy. We want to get that uh, that hit check up. All right. You see there's the doorway right there. You going on in or are you doing something else? Hold on. Let me check out the whole map. Anything we're forgetting. Didn't we promise to go back to some of these, please? Well, I guess we didn't. Like Only one. Any but we can't go back to what we've tried. Well, there's this one. We already went back to Gravity Falls. Did we? Yeah, we did. Yeah, once. we did. Now he asked us not to come back, actually. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we did. I was like, yeah, we did. All right, yeah, I guess, yeah. This, this purple world, but uh, we've yeah. already been there once, and they um, basically there's nothing we can do to help it. So moving on. Yeah, it's too new for Atlantis. So, yeah, let's go. <clears throat> All right, and you all enter the Gummy Highway. Immediately upon entering, you see a large, large creature. 
just walking along the surface of the map ahead of you. <laughs> and around the, the landscape, you see it's just like a very barren area with just some cracks and crevices going into the ground. <clears throat> Did he re-equip all of our stuff? Yes. <clears throat> so any repair checks before you go or just calling it good? I think we have we were full on everything, weren't we? Because we just he just made it from the like previous. Oh, yeah. <laughs> That's a good point. I was like, oh gosh. That's what kind of shadow point. mechanic is this? <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. So I need to roll a pilot check. Yep. Also, do you want me to roll my will my will check? Yes. Is that pass? That's not you're not rolling to pass. The will check. You're rolling to determine Oh, the will check. Uh I remember if it was so. thirty or thirty five. I thought I know it was twenty five before, and I think you can increase it to thirty. Uh let me scroll down to my notes. Uh yeah, that's a pass. Boom. Alright. No spirit die. Alright, now here is the pilot check. All right, you keeping that re-rolling? Hell yeah, I'm keeping that. All right, so your AC is 21. So you see that large creature? Are we shooting it? Well, I don't know. I haven't seen what it really is yet. Oh, it's a Heartless. Okay. <laughs> I to see a red border. It's good enough for me. I've done a full movement action. That means you guys can't hit, right? I don't know, yeah. I believe that is correct. Yep, if you're in a full movement. Oh, gosh, there's two of them. There are. Yeah, there's another one over there. All right, and you see this thing starts walking. You're currently flying, like, just above it. Just barely out of its range. And it just keeps walking. It does not attack you. Should we attack it, or should we just leave it be? Well, I'll leave that to your call. Are we feeling risky? I, mean, I can't even see its health. <laughs> I say we take one down. All right. Or at least try. Show me what you got. I won't, I'll forgo my movement then. Yeah, let's do it, Ryzen. Yep, Ryzen gets two shots. Shinji, you get the one. GG. Uh, say that again? What'd there. you say? It cut out. You get two shots. Well, there's the laser. Wait, you did the laser? Why wouldn't I? We don't know how much help this thing has. No, well, it's already been shot. All right, you have both shot. It is now its turn. It misses. What misses? It. It misses. The enemy? Yeah. <laughs> it keeps moving. Doesn't attack. See, we're fine. I guess now I feel kicks. bad. Now I feel bad for shooting it because it's not doing anything. <laughs> now nah, for for kicks, I'm gonna roll a perception check. This we'll is a kind of arsenal it has. Yeah. Direct but. analogy, and that might be the best word. Uh, this is a direct pull from uh, what this thing does in the actual uh, game too. And uh, what happens when you kill it will also be a direct pull from that game. That's where I'm rolling this perception check, even though it's trash. All right. Uh, you see the Heartless is just uh, still walking along the surface, going, just just going. All right, I'm looking to see what kind of arsenal it has, kind of weapons or anything. It seems to be completely unarmed. That's going to be nipping that. going to just say we attack it again. Let's do it. All right, Ryzen can't attack, so if you want to attack, go ahead. Yep. All right, you kill it. Roll a 1d12. It could be good or bad. <laughs> you get a Protega G. Oh. Oh, well, yeah, I'll take that. Let's go get that other one. All right. 
And I've got two Protega G's. You went that way, sir. I'm just nervous because he said after it happens. And then it's like, what does that mean? What, 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 what's the experience <laughs> on that thing? Oh, yeah, I didn't add that to these tokens, did I? Uh, oh, that thing doesn't give experience. Oh, it just drops, it just drops stuff. Okay. Is that a shadow or is that like um, a mountain? That is one of like the crevices in the ground. <clears throat> I won't see it yet. And you're free to fly over that stuff as well. Oh, okay. Right, are you sure you're moving your full movement with your engine uh, and everything? Oh, it's 60 at a time. Jeez. Uh, hold up. I wasn't paying attention that first time, so I didn't see what was happening. Uh, Shinji has good. replaced his face with the gummy ship. <clears throat> Bye. That was freaking weird. I um, I was only moving in 30 increments because that's as far as my, I can see. So We can still move further than that. All right. Uh, Shinji, do you see anything? Yeah, I see it. Which way? It's right up ahead. About 40 feet that way. You didn't see anything. I didn't see anything. You didn't see anything there. <laughs> All right. You gonna attack this one? Oh, yeah, that's no your war, second boss. So there is no war. There is no war, bossing say. That's the rest of my movement. It moves. I guess it's still only uh, Ryzen hitting at this point. I mean, uh, uh, Shinji hitting at this point. Unless you waited. We didn't. Cool. Then yeah, one more turn. I mean, enough turns have gone by. I'd say it's uh, refreshed. Are we shooting this thing? Mm-hmm. Laser. All right. Actually, yes. You shoot that with 50. Shinji, you hit it with 30. You take it down in one shot. Ryzen, you rolled second, so you get to roll the 1d12. <clears throat> but I don't want it. I don't care. Well, that's too dang bad. Yeah, you're going <sighs> to keep on rolling. All right, primary gunner, nine. That is a Comet G. You're right. Yeah. You don't want it. Well, that's too dang bad. But I'm tired <laughs> of digging, Grandpa. Hey, pilot, roll a perception check. <laughs> I'm really happy. This is the exact scenario I wanted to have happen, by the way. Us shooting these? It's specifically, uh, you taking that one down with your laser. Graham, cool. luckily, you see this. You see, as its body collapses to the ground and it disappears, a rumbling starts to occur, and out of the crevices... The crevasse. Something's coming out. You know us too well. You know I love treasure. But you baited me. You know I couldn't resist the treasure. <laughs> now this is different from what it does in the game. <clears throat> then I want a refund. Okay. Here's yeah, your free back. 99. Yes. <laughs> Fucking children. Jesus Christ, Travis. Get a grip. <laughs> this is the guy who was 40 minutes late to the D&D. Sorry. One of the fourth times she's fucking walked in here today. <laughs> Sounds like you need to get a belt. Sounds like you need to get a, your wife on a better schedule. Yeah, dude, trust me. But it wasn't her fault, so I can't get mad at her. I was kidding. All right, Shinji, you're the only one that can do anything. I mean, I can move, but... Ryzen has lasered it, so... Pew! He's risened it. Hell yeah. Yeah, that one, right. you take it down. Five experience. Ooh. Proud of you. 
No, they'll go. Nope. Uh, I sensed the fourth one. Oh, oops. I didn't seventh see that. one. Uh, I'm gonna go the fourth or the seventh one. I can feel it. I have a sixth sense for these things. All right, so you're ramming through it coming back? Yes. Roll damage. Let's see. You went right to there. I'm hearing Tevin, by the way, Ryzen. Not sure what changed. Okay, so everything up to that one. Uh, so you you going back through them, so that's hitting them twice. Do it again. All right, with that, you take down one, two, three, four, five, six, seven of them. Total of 35 experience, and you will take a total of seven damage for each hit. Wait, uh, a set, seven? sorry, a seven damage for each uh, movement. Oh, like holy! Smokes. So total like, fourteen. Oh, fourteen. I was gonna say, wow, we lose. Oh, my God. bad. Oh, yeah, that was my my poor wording there. <laughs> I was like, oh, I misconstrued oh, that situation completely. <laughs> All right, now it's their turn. I saw a lot of lines. Yeah, let, let me. The, the fourth hit or the seventh hit. I can feel it. Maybe the 12th. It's a bit of a stretch. Maybe the 17th. 24th? You see a lot of them are coming by. All right, wait, before we continue, like, who wants to take wagers on how many there are? Like, just a random guess how many are out there. Who wants to guess? This thing's going to actually move over there as well. Um. I'm I gotta ask, did I inspire you for this map or something? I oh, don't worry, this is a much simpler combat because all you have to do is shoot laser the laser. Beam. Yeah. But laser beam. There's at least 32 I'm... droid flashbacks. Oh, Ooh, there's a tooltip. 5 XP. Yeah. Connor? But this is gonna take like uh, 5 minutes to get through, most likely. Worst the case Star scenario, Wars they're all just gonna suicide bomb you. What? In the Star Wars D&D, I expect a shout out. To the droids and to the droids. <laughs> oh, sorry. I'm trying to. I'm trying to move. Here, I'll go back. I'm trying to move to where I don't hit anything at this point, but I can't see past a certain point. So, bear with me. Why don't me. you just sit still and let me just shoot them? Because you can't. The dro- it's back up now. After one turn? No, it's not. He can't shoot the laser, but he can shoot regular attacks now. Okay, yeah. we still can't kill them all, and they're gonna ram us. <laughs> let them. Maybe if we be a better pilot first. and they won't list lazily to the left and you'll be just fine. Well, here, I'm going to move out of the range of most of them and you can still shoot one. Just like the watch, Travis, list lazily to the left. Please don't touch lazily. Look, I don't roll your hit checks. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so that was one movement. And are you, are you guys running? I'm going to run a little bit while you guys fire and kill a couple at a time. Hopefully you may land a hit check. Yeah, I don't need to land hit checks. Ugh. All right, Shinji. Uh, which one are you shooting? I'll shoot this one. All right, you kill that one. It's five experience. <clears throat> so I get one shot or two shot? One shot. One. One. One opportunity. Would you capture it? No. One last chance. Uh, both are hits. Wait, why do you shoot twice? Didn't he just say I shoot twice? I no, one. I said once. Oh, well, then I'm retarded. Is the 16 one. still a hit then? I was trying to. I was like trying to run that through my head too. While I was changing. <laughs> while I was changing the number here on my note. I was like, <laughs> something's not right here. I'll figure it out in a minute. We'll get there. Well, ten damage. All right. It is still up. Uh, this thing is going to charge at you Shinji and slam into you killing itself not giving experience Uh, but it's also going to do damage here in a minute we're just going to do it all right at the very end that thing's going to do it so that's three please four five auto hit oh yeah six yeah they're suicide bombing you Uh, they deal two damage per hit with them doing this so you've taken 12 damage from that. 12. But of course we're not done there. One. Two. Three. Four. Five. Six. Seven. Eight. 
two. Uh, teeny ship's gone. Three, four, five, six. Twelve. And four. seven. <clears throat> Fourteen. Now these ones are going to start going for the main ship. One, two. I'm a half HP already. Three, four, <laughs> five. I said we just ram them. Six, seven, Shut up. eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. Total of twenty six damage. You see the rest of them start moving up. <coughs> All right, drill formation. We just run through. I have thirty health left on the ship. We never take a guess, did we? No, we don't look to that much, laser. We don't really know how much health they have. We know that uh, me hitting them twice a minute ago killed them, but that was 22 damage. How long to that laser? Three turns. Three more turns. All right. Hypothetically, do you see the, do you see the way out, Shinji? I do not see the way out, and I have not thus far. Um, but does it, well, I guess we could probably go a little bit further back. It might be in this. Should just be one three. more turn. One more turn. Three turns total. I thought it was five. Where am I getting five? Well, five is the base, but you have the the coolant G, right? Uh no. Oh, okay. Then the recovery. Uh, then you are not able to attack yet. See, that's where I was confused initially. Yeah, the the cooldown for the laser itself is five. Correct. And then you also have a cooldown before you can actually do anything, which it's is up two. Which two was turns. which that one was on the second yeah. When you I just was... did your last attack, that was your first turn still. <clears throat> or sorry, the the Man. before the last but on when you just did your last attack, that was still the second turn second turn. So that attack oh, couldn't have happened. It wasn't the third. Well, then I'll just bypass this one. I can try to outrun half of them again. I don't know what their movement is, but I could try. My I've never bed. rolled a cool G. Nope. Also, hypothetically, like if I decided to hop onto my uh, my keyblade, like how how would that combat look? Like, do I use my keyblade and I ram them? Does it have HP? He feels that you can't call upon your Keyblade armor inside the Gummy Highway. Alright, big as much. We have Alright, so, uh... <laughs> <laughs> not in the highway. Not in the highway. Yeah, not yet. Right. So I guess the best way I could think of to do it would be... Oh, hold on. I'm counting. If we want to put some distance, then... This way would be that way. I can't do it. I'd kill me. Or... You could ram through these. You would just like do a board. What's your full movement? I have 120. Yeah, we can just ram through like, what is this? One, two, three, four, five. But we don't know if it's going to kill them. Oh, no, we just ran. Like, I'm just saying, like. It's okay. I've made my decision. There's enough of them to where I will survive if they all suicide bomb me. I need to get try to get away as as far as possible. Oh, my God. (laughs) <laughs> GG. Now what I was saying was just like go straight. It is like <laughs> yeah. just right run through them. Yeah. To escape. You see another enemy. Uh-huh. This, this thing looks to be a bit more dangerous. Oh yeah. By the way, I, I, maybe I should should have mentioned this earlier. Uh, I have in my notes like a timeline of what worlds to go to world uh, when. And there's like early worlds, mid worlds, and I have little notes next to them. Uh, this one you have now entered late worlds. Shit gets real. I'm gonna go into the drive and see if I can find these notes and verify this. Yeah, that says 50 XP too. You stay out of those Just, notes. I won't do that. So uh, that was your full movement. I guess you're waiting on me now, aren't you? No, we yes. got a we got a minute. No, we have another two two movement. <laughs> He's got a block, so. That's it to both miss. of you. Uh, that's a mess. Cool. It's blockage. both of us. Yeah, this targets both of you. 
I block it, Shinji. Okay, well, so I guess I'll block them. You can block the main ship, but the, uh, the shots starting you will still hit you. Yeah, that's fine. Okay. I'll crash and burn. Oh, low roll. Six damage. Oh, my goodness. Rip. <laughs> oh, I mean... At least Better safe than sorry. Am I allowed to repair on the gummy highway? <laughs> no. Not mid-combat. Once you first enter, right when you leave, that's when you can. How about just flying around, listing lazily, lazily to the left? If there are no enemies coming after you to the point where Graham's not like, you know, like piloting the ship, going wah, 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 then yeah, you'd be allowed to. But currently he's going wah, wah, wah. Want to wah, wah, wah a little harder so we don't get hit by six? Wow, wow, wow. I'm going to go ahead and use a um, faith cord. What the fuck? Two of those two are suiciding into Shinji. <laughs> they can now move ten more feet. There are those ones. <coughs> All right. What you doing, Graham? Looking for the exit. It might be uh, right next to you. You never know. Uh, here's hoping. There's the first 60 feet. And no objections going to fly in. <laughs> but that 50 XP, though... The XP is going to be there forever. We're never going to see it again. Bye. <laughs> what about the laser? The laser's not up yet. <laughs> yeah, tragic, isn't it? <laughs> That's life sometimes, though, you know? You sometimes you get out. lasered. Sometimes you take the laser. Yeah. Sometimes. sometimes. That's pretty much what I was going to say. Sometimes you get the laser. Sometimes the laser gets you. And you will see. Let's make sure I've got the right thing here. Sure don't. Let's do that. Delete that. Robot fucking city. I knew it. Robot city. Call Isn't it. that DreamWorks? Call All it. right. So we've had this conversation before. And technically, yes, I have made a mistake. But it was distributed by Fox, which is now Disney. And that's the justification I'm using. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, he fucked up. Ladies and gentlemen, Mr. Yes. Conway Twitty. <laughs> Mistakes were made. There's no disagreements about that. But you know what? I already had you encounter this person in a silhouette in the past. So here we are. I called it. I called it. I called it. There's also it some insane. slight mess up with the token with the black border. If you're wondering about that, that's just, that's just I, I fucked up and I forgot to fix it. We're landing. In a robotic clicking city. All right, you flying into the world? Uh, Ryzen, do you want to repair the ship? Why don't we just do it there? We're not in danger now. Okay, sure. <laughs> <laughs> you fly into the world. You find yourself flying above a an intense city full of automation and mechanical makeup. Part what of it's a very this? gear, like gearbox and clockwork type uh, mechanics. Other bits of it are very uh, surprisingly flowing for uh, technology, circular, kind of going off of based phys uh, physics based technology. It's like, oh. But everything seems uh, robotic or mechanical in one form or another. What's happening? And as you're all looking in the, in the city below you, you find a spot where you can safely land. Next to a large metal door outside of a bustling courtyard. Down with you. Oh, God. <laughs> I remember this fucking movie now. 100%. <laughs> All right. Flying Dash. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> Gee, <Flying> yeah. <laughs> Oh, I should do one other thing here. Or the win. Nobody look. Nobody look. Nobody look. Nobody look. That's to you, audience. Sorry, I just had to put something on the GM layer in here. Okay, I have to update my token anyway. I no longer am at that health. Or MP for that rather matter. Congrats. So looking around, you do see a few other people. Obviously, I don't have tokens for them. Uh, aside from the guy who you see in front of the door. Looks like a very shiny little robot man. We see everyone here. All the people. People. 
It's going to be mechanical, made of robot parts. Ryzen, are you going to work uh, your magic? Uh, yeah. A bippity bippity boo boo boo. And you cast your magic, making you all look robotic. I don't have tokens for that. God damn it, Connor. I'm not going to make tokens for all that stuff. <laughs> yeah, but we're not critical role here. We can't spend $25,000 an episode. That, that's the low budget cost, by the way. <laughs> they specifically said they require twenty or require 7,000 subs to break even on their show. And that is exactly $25,000 as a partner. Well, based on if they haven't negotiated a different rate, but yes. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. That's what they officially said is breaking even. There are other uh, episodes where they say it ranges between 35000 and 50000 per episode. One day. So, yeah, sorry that we can't, you know, go up to that level. Fuck you, Nick. Fuck you. He's not watching this anyway. Watch this. Exactly. Like Rex call out. Exactly. Yeah, yeah, take that. All right, anyway, what y'all doing? <laughs> All right, who put on their armor? It's my robot. <laughs> robot uh, <laughs> guys. you know what sure <laughs> you can put your uh your uh keyblade armor on if you want yeah, from a distance it looks like a robot for me <laughs> you can update the stats on that uh token to reflect your actual stats and you can just use that for the session i don't get to see this too much Whoa, the numbers are there. That's weird. The numbers, Mason. Yeah. Uh, yeah <laughs> you make Ooh, contact. all right. I'm real sorry about that, Shinji. I'm going to need you to re-put those numbers in. <laughs> GG. No, sorry. That's Yours bad. was the token <laughs> I was making the adjustments to first, and uh, it That's saved right. the zero <laughs> values. <laughs> For uh, Star Wars, this will be fixed. Is I'll have these presets in for every token. Yeah, cool. Now that we've learned how to do that, that was a useful tidbit for me to learn, huh? <laughs> I'm so mad. Much. I'm so mad it's taken so long for me to realize we, I could do that. Life's nice learning experience. Yeah. You can change <laughs> default token settings and dynamic lighting settings for that matter. GG. But All they right. still haven't fixed the circle drawing. <laughs> You also can't uh, draw hexagons if you're not using hexa the hexagraph thing. Like I don't think I've ever shown you guys this, but this is something I can do. I like interesting. You Maybe can even you move your polygon. yeah. You can even move your tokens within the actual hexagons themselves, but you can't draw anything. Like if I try and lock the shape, it still just draws a square. Yeah, oh. I have to like actually. Oh, yeah, I'd have to manually do that. It's actually kind of giving me a headache. <laughs> Yeah, you're not used to it. It's also, for whatever reason, a brighter color. More standard D&D. Maybe it just display. seems more. And it's an optical illusion, I feel like. Oh, nice to me. I, I intended to actually use that for one of the maps uh, in Star Wars, um, but once I realized I can't draw to it and I'd have to do it all manual, I was like, ah, fuck that. This is a map where it made sense to use uh, hexagons or more, that kind of a shape. All right, anyway, what y'all doing? All right, guys. Let's go talk to that guy. Let's go find that keyhole. Puts his head down. Well, howdy there, fellas. How can I help you? Howdy. We're just, uh... Where's, where's the guy going to get some, uh... Oil around here? Is that something? Yeah, we got plenty of shops around. <laughs> <laughs> kind of a weird question you know here uh yeah yeah oh well here how about you head on into the building here and you can just get some complimentary free oil on us so he clicks a button and the door opens wow, up thanks. all right and then you go to step through the door yes <laughs> you make your way towards the door to go step through it and immediately see the door slam shut in front of you. He just starts, oh, 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 you really thought it'd just be that easy? Yeah, we just give you free things? Oh, you want my paycheck while we're at it? Yeah. Yeah, if you don't mind. Uh, you're... Hmm. That must be uh, defective, huh? <laughs> I mean, you sound like the defective one right now, Connor, because you keep bugging out. 
Am I bugging out? Yeah, a little bit. Yeah, man. A little it bit. goes great with your character. It's so weird. <laughs> I used so, to hear you, but it was like a... Part of the issue is, for whatever reason, we're going... Our server is on Atlanta right now. Oh, Discord. On what? The server is at Atlanta. All right, ideally... I wouldn't have pink spikes now. But I see I already have just had a pink spike, so... Fuck me, I guess. GG. Well. I don't even know what would be causing it. It's just ISP issues, most likely. I'm still boning you. To this day. It's just random. That's the most frustrating part. About that paycheck. Yeah, I'm, I'm not going to give you that. That was a joke. Sarcasm. All right. Sarcasm? What model is that? He looks at you. Yeah, I thought I had a sarcasm once. What? what what's your model number? Uh, what can I roll? <laughs> Let's just go there. Uh, deception? <laughs> How about a friendship? I'm trying uh, to make friends with this robot. Appeal to its programming. Uh, If you want to, yeah, you'll have to say something that's going to be friendly afterwards, but yeah. Okay. your friend check that's my friendship yeah what are you saying <laughs> i'm the i am the model luv what about you luv huh yeah you see like hesitate he puts his hand over another button you see he's like thinking about it <sighs> you're not worth it thank you you are worth it thank you all right that's enough we need to get inside this building. What do we need to do? Well, what model are you, Graham? B8537. Oh. <laughs> I'm not familiar with that one either, but uh, at least you could say it. What was wrong with mine? There's made no sense. L-U-V? L -U it spells love. Do you think no, I'm doesn't. stupid? Love is spelled L-O-V-E. So now I do. I will call security. It is spelled L-U-V. <laughs> Alright, so uh, what do you need to get inside for, huh? You must surely have an appointment, right? No. Oh, well, I guess that means you're not getting in there. I'm going to walk over to the door and tap it with my keyblade. I didn't think about that. That's a fucking good point. You tap with the keyblade, you see it opens. He goes, oh, what the? He immediately slams it shut again. <laughs> Listen, son, we can do this all day. Listen, if you're not going to tell me what you're going in for, then I'm not going to keep this door open for you. So he's just running his hand over the close button again, looking at you, Graham. <laughs> can I roll a computer use check, like... In front of whatever he is, like where the button is, to try and see if I can like unplug something. Roll a darkness check, and we're just gonna portal to the other side. <laughs> Roll a computer use check, sure. Yeah. yeah. While he's doing that, I'm saying we're we're looking for some information. Uh, you are confident that this is more clockwork than it is uh standard can system I stuff. Pull a gear out. I know what to do. Perhaps. You know what? I'm going to make this real easy. So it's gears that are constantly rotating. Is that right? Yeah. Wait, I know what to do. I'm just going to well, roll stop they're shut while it's They're currently they're shut while it's... Say, they're not moving while it's not say, doing anything. I'm just, yeah, I'm just going to Let use, me open it and you stop. I was going to say that. Yeah, that's what I would like to do. <laughs> well, okay, okay, before that, Shinji, what were you saying? I said, uh, <laughs> I'm going to say we're looking for some information. All right, what kind of information are you looking for? Uh, any Any bad things been happening in the city lately? Mysterious. So bad things, like mysterious. How? Things that wouldn't normally happen in the city. We're getting a little more riffraff here in my case. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Matt well, can't think of too much. Whoa, well, wait! There is actually. Oh, hey, there's one now. You see something, Pierce? No. Give me a second. Got to scroll down to it. 
I think I should have did my tightest laugh. Dun. You see a shadow appear. Snap the button. He goes, all right, uh, step away from the door, please. He clicks the button. You see it uh, immediately all opens up again. And you see a number of other robots come on out. Who are these yeah. guys? You see one of them walks up to the shadow and just immediately stabs its hand into it. And it just dissipates. And then they turn around, immediately go back inside, and the door closes behind them. We are model number 911. Says those are the security bots. Look, I don't want any trouble. How do we make an appointment? All right, well, uh, who are you trying to make an appointment with? Whoever it takes to get inside this building. All right, that would be an appointment with me. Oh, what time works for you? <laughs> Ooh, snap. Right now. Five minutes? How does that sound? Oh, yeah, five minutes right now? Which one? Uh, yeah, five minutes from now. All right. Pencils it in. He doesn't pencil it in. He just like, uh, he acts like he's penciling it in. And he just sits down. All right, no, so I'll see you in five minutes. <laughs> no, no, but seriously. Is there anybody who can tell us about those th- those things that just appeared? Hmm. Hmm, maybe. How often does maybe. that happen? Uh, pretty regularly. Most of the security bots around the town take care of them, though. With these, there's never any bigger ones? No. I guess there were a couple of bigger ones in the past, but uh, we got bigger robots to take care of them. Do you know where they're spawning from? Nope. Is there a part in town, an area in town where they show up more often? I don't know. You're not very helpful, are you? I was paranoid. I didn't even start recording for a second. I just hate it when that flash (laughs) happens. Uh, What was it they said, Graham? You're not very helpful, are you? I don't know what you're talking about. I've answered every single one of your questions to the best of my ability. How high is this wall? Uh, 30 feet. So unless you have any better information to tell me, then uh, I don't know what to tell you. No, thanks for all your help. Like we haven't, like we haven't done this in every single place we've been. We're here to stop <laughs> those things from coming. All right, that doesn't quite help me. Where, where, where are you three from? You foreigners? Yes. Yeah, you can say All right. That. Where do you come from, and what's your business here? Where did you come from? Where did you go? Like we, you came from, we came from off world. We're here to stop the darkness. Kind of looks at you. I was told to expect people that had more. Not metal. Alright, here you go. Slams the door open. You're gonna go inside, take the elevator to the very top building, and go to the room, uh. And go to the main room. Oh, yeah. Alright, I'm gonna start doing a robot dance. That was my perform check. Gonna roll a sense motive. That just seems really easy. He feels though that did seem really easy, but as far as you can tell, this guy doesn't have any uh, nefarious purpose behind it. Groovy moves. Oh my god. <laughs> she just does the robot. You could try dancing like Britney Spears. <laughs> that happens in the movie. GG. Really? <laughs> yeah. The robot played by Robin Williams. Hit me, baby, one more time, plays in it. And he starts dancing. Off we go. Now right, she's waiting for Ryzen. What am I rolling? You just walked. I didn't know you. <laughs> no, we're, we're oh, gotcha. I was no, like, I was just what, are we, what are we waiting for? <laughs> no, I, was, I was excited we got through, so I started dancing. And then we just walked through. <laughs> I need those tokens first. You make your way into the building, you go up the elevator, you follow his instructions exactly as they are laid out. And then you find yourself in a nice room with a view and a very shiny robot ahead of you. <clears throat> he already has a red border. Yeah, first. To be fair, there were a few ways you could get inside this. 
Uh, and most of them were evil, and I thought I should probably give them a neutral border. Uh, and then I decided, eh. <laughs> Why would we need that? So you see this man, he looks at you as you enter. So I was told to expect you. Oh. And we're, yes. uh, we're here for our 7 o'clock. It's 11. Oh, sorry. We're a little late. Hmm. Ran into some traffic. <laughs> Please, take a seat across from On me. the gummy highway. Magic. I said across from me. I didn't hear you. <laughs> like, I actually didn't hear you. <laughs> <laughs> like, so, I, I her to take a seat. What are you all doing here today? We came to uh, save your world. We're exterminators. We've come to exterminate the pest problem you had around the city. The pest problem? I presume you mean the heartless. That breaks. <laughs> you know their name. <laughs> Yes, uh, truth be told, I am not too familiar with what they are myself, but my mother's told me. And typically I like not to talk about her, but I figure with you all, I'm safe in being frank about this. Sure, so your name's Frank? No, you can call me Ratchet. Ratchet. Where's Clank? (laughs) Is that number five or number six? <clears throat> so, you all are... What was it? Some dumb, inefficient name. Key? key was it the Key Sword people? Warriors of Light. Yeah, Warriors of Light. That's a much better name. See, I can respect the light. He looks at his armor and see how it shines with the sun. He says, I can respect things that are nice and fresh and good. So, I've been told that I can escort you towards where the uh, keyhole is and uh, help you seal it. That'd be wonderful. All right. And uh, then we can all just go on our own separate ways once this happens? Sure. Sure, absolutely. Fantastic. Uh you see he looks down at his he looks down at something that's uh lit up on in on the uh table in front of him. Uh, give me just a second. He reaches under, grabs a phone. Uh-huh. Wait, right now? Uh uh, uh stop him. Don't let him get in. Uh, alert the guards, everything. Do anything you need to to stop him. Uh, uh, he hangs up the phone. Uh here, here, we'll continue this in just a moment. Uh just need to. All right, let's see. What what do I need to do here? How how do I think this through? How do I? Okay. Uh. At that moment, you see a large metal man comes in the door. Clank, clank. With a smaller metal man next to him. He rolls up, slamming the door. The the chair is out of the way as he goes by. Dang, that's a big guy. That's one big it, robot. It, you see, as he's going up to this guy, this guy's walking up, he looks at you all. Wow, those are some... That's some nice, uh... Oh, God, I can't think of the word at the moment. Luster? Aesthetic? <laughs> Say, like, your Please. shell. Uh, Exterior? Uh, I guess you could say, like, nice um, chassis. There it is. Rise and Spirit Die. That's some Ooh. nice uh, chassis and everything you have there. Well, Thank you. Exterior? Man. You uh, <laughs> friends of Ratchet? Uh, well, we're about to be. Well, that's a that's a shame. Bro, just kidding. And then you see this man goes up and he starts like poking it out Ratchet's chest. He goes, "You think that you can take my company from me and outmode thousands of millions of robots?" He says, "Not on my watch. I'm taking back control." This guy turns to you all. He says. I, I think we can be uh, reasonable here. Uh, I've agreed to help you find young gentlemen. Uh, so uh, help me take him down. He immediately jumps behind the uh, the big circular seat here. 
Well, before we jump to conclusions, because we don't really know either of you. He turns to you, looks at you. You're not familiar with me? No. We're warriors of light. We're not from here. Listen, it's a whole thing. We're trying to stop the, the darkness and heartless from attacking your city. So now, why are you trying to take over his company? Let's start there. Uh, this is my... Now let's see if I can get his voice better. This is my company, first off. Oh. Why is he in your office, then? Why? Because I've allowed him to watch over my city while I've been busy doing other things. But now I realize that he's been running it completely into the ground. And not profit-wise. It's Profit's been soaring. But in terms of morality, he's been running it straight into the ground. Ah. Oh. So you're an ethics-based company, I see. Of course. We make replacement parts for all the good robots. I'm really amazed you haven't heard of me, actually. So what does he do? That's so That's so bad. He's outmoding them, making new parts that are too expensive and can't be uh, replaced for uh, older models. Essentially oh, meaning that they're all going to shut down and die. I've heard of you. Is it called Apple? It's like, Apple? That's a nice name for a company. Uh, it seems more like something he'd name it, though. Yeah, this is more like no company, uh, phone company that exists. <laughs> like... Interesting. Well, I guess ultimately, what would you like to see happen? Me? I want my company back. I want him out of it so that way I can start fixing all the robots that are around. If you're here after darkness, start with him. He's, a, he's the most heartless person I've ever met. I'm going to roll a sense motive, and I'm hoping I can use this like roll for both of them. Does that make sense? Like... Understand the other one's eagerness. You feel as though he is being genuine with everything he's saying, and you feel as though this guy's definitely a bit more of a shady character. He's going to well, start crawling guys. around. He's going to start crawling around here, start walking up behind y'all. Like, no, nah, no, nah, friends, friends, we can work through this. After all, you, uh... You... You should talk to my mother about this. Tell you what, uh, I'm gonna go get her, or you can meet her down, uh, down at her, down at her part of the company. Uh, yeah, yeah, don't let's move. let's wait. do that. Wait, wait, can uh, I say, hold on. Before he walks away from me, can I say, don't move another mus, don't move another inch, or I'll strike you down right here. I'll have him stop right there. Oh, but he was right there when I was gonna say it. Uh, okay, okay. Because I wanted to use the tech opportunity. <laughs> You're just going to have his hands up? Okay. So why don't you just... I look back at the big guy. Why don't you just fire him then? Say, so that's exactly what I came here to do. Okay. Then have the guards... Have the guards we saw earlier escort him out of the company. Yeah, that's exactly what we should do. Guards! He snaps his finger. You that see out of the room, a number of them come on out of the walls. That's whenever combat starts. I was gonna say I can see where this is going. Let's go yep. south. Look at those, look at those red borders. Correct, but this is the—it's not red borders. That's hell. But this is the correct way. This is the correct way to go about it. That way we know for sure who the bad guy is. It's true. Hey, spirit die. Thank you. Say so escort, escort, ratchet out of here. So they go up. This one goes up, grabs him, starts guiding him away, guides him towards the door. And then it releases him. His wretched says, All right, now, guard bots, take them down. He starts running. Rip. <laughs> yes, hey, you listen to me. I pay, I pay your paychecks. And they all just keep stepping forward, ready for combat. Guard bots, stand down. All right, with the shot. <laughs> all right, Ryzen, you're up. I was first in turn order? Yeah. With you rolled a, a whopping 10, yeah. I rolled an 8. In Holy Graham fuck, six. guys. Jesus Christ. Um, Actually, look at that tool tip, though. I'm, I'm going to use... He doesn't, he doesn't have reaction command. Oh. Mm, should I... Is I'm going to try something that's risky. There, Shinji? It's, it's either you. going to... I'm hoping that this will short-circuit them. I'm going to use Thunder 
on this one right here. All right. I'm going to start. I'm going to do three hits, but I want to see it. You know, I need to know the health before I just are these. These aren't considered heartless, right? Uh, correct. They're not. So first hit. That'll be the second hit. That sucks. So and where they are. That one GT. Pretty sure it's just uh, one hit. One hit. But it's thunder. So you know what yep. that means. The Dara. Last. Wow. You see, they each take 30 damage. No short circuiting or anything? Mm mm. Mm. Right. The robot, the metagame here is the robots in this world are made almost purely of mechanical and clockwork type of machinery. It is not electric based. True, so I know what I'm doing next. But, but I need to reduce my MP. And that would be my turn because I did full round. So, all right. Next. Oh, do they need to roll fortitude? Their pocket sand. <laughs> uh, oh, yes, they will need to do that. DC 15 currently, correct? Yeah. Wow. Okay. They all pass. Graham, what you gonna do? What you gonna do? What you gonna do He's when done. they come for you? You mean Shinji? Shinji, that's what I meant to say. What you gonna do? What you gonna do when they come for you? Do it. Do, 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 do. Is is this tool tip meant to encourage me to do that, or like? That is so you know the reaction command that they have. All right, cool. All right, I want to abuse that. Uh, so I'm just gonna go ahead. And, you can use uh, that if you want. Go ahead. You are all aware of that. The, that is the reaction command because Graham has scan. You are all aware of their stats. Oh, gotcha. well, it, then. Uh, from my seat safely. Do we have water? No, we just have water. No, we have water. All right, cool. I thought you had water. Use water. Oh, so I would have seen that tool sure. tip if you had you reaction. Had reaction. Command. reaction no. command. What <laughs> magic do you not have at uh, tier two? By the way, what? Flare, Stopper, and Blizzara. Uh, gr did we get gravity? <laughs> yeah, we got gravity. Oh. Say that one more time for me, Shinji. I just want to make a note of this. Make sure I'm reflect, giving them and reflect, stop, and... I don't know. I, I don't think mine's updated. It's just reflect and stop if we have gravity. Blizzard, too. No, we have that. We do? Yeah. Cool, so no. just reflect and stop. Before yeah, okay, I, good. I have updated my stuff. <laughs> Thank you. That is very good. It means I'm where I'm intending to be. Oh. Is in a uh, water. Water. All right, head check. <coughs> magic, magic, magic. Oh, oh, oh! It's miss. Rip. Then I'll move up. Intern. All right, Graham. Move there, and I'm going to do Strike Raid. <clears throat> All right, let's see it. Let's see that macro. All righty, both hits. You learned how to do macros, huh? Yeah, Mike showed me. Nice. Sweet macros. I used to do them, but then with how much was just kept changing, I was like, I'm not going to keep up with this. <laughs> I can tell you they will exist in Star Wars. But you also have the full Star character Wars. sheet. In uh in roll twenty, so you can also just like click a button on the character sheet and it'll roll it. Oh, that's cool. And yeah. then I will roll a uh, I will do a uh, heroic surge and do it one more time. Alrighty. Did you do that or you was killed it already in the in the Bitch. system? It was already in the system. Yeah, I figured. <clears throat> yeah. I tried to figure out how to do it with HSG heroes, but you have to convert it to HTML and like everything and i was like yeah even when i tried to convert it it didn't do it right yeah i tried to experiment with it too with the start of kingdom hearts it just i was just not it was not going well it would have been the ugliest character sheet of all time or synthesis materials 
All right. See this guy? He goes, wow, you guys are some cool fighters. Uh, if you need any help on me, I'm really... He pulls out a wrench. Uh, I'm really good at dismantling robots and putting them back together. So if that can come in handy, uh, just let me know. It costs one MP for him to completely dismantle a standard enemy. Okay. And now it's their just turn. dismantle an enemy? What Any standard fuck? enemy, he's just able to immediately take them apart. Cool. Oh, well, I'm going to get hit. These things are also on wheels, so they have boosted... Uh... Yep. All right, that one goes up to uh, to a big weld. Uh, who you, whose name you don't know yet. And he just slams him in the head and you see he starts acting kind of funky. Aye, 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 Zordon. And now each of these ones will attack you once. So that will be to Ryzen, Shinji, Graham. And 15 hits? is a miss. Miss. Uh, I think it's a miss. <laughs> I should just double check that. Pretty I've been sure coughing so much lately. I feel like classic Mike. Classic Mike. Mike. No. <sighs> That's a mix of classic Mike and Zach. <laughs> there are a lot of those classic audio issues. Here, I can be classic Travis. <clears throat> GG. Oh, hey, I, I can be classic Zach. <laughs> Rip. Look at all this. Not even good. That was good because you're still here. <laughs> GG. You need to not show up for about ten chapters. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> I'll be classic <laughs> Connor. Hi, welcome to Naruto D and D. <laughs> Hi, welcome to Ruby. Hi, welcome to FMA. Hi, welcome to King Mars. Hi, welcome to Star Wars. Hey, I'll I'll be classic Travis. All right, uh, so that's one D twenty plus. Uh, hold on, I gotta add that up. <laughs> I <laughs> I remember when I started editing the episodes more heavily, which was way too late into the series of Naruto. I remember like there was one bit where it was in the Ninja War, and I was just like, "This has been a three minute thing waiting for Travis to do the math and roll." <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> and I was just like, uh, I can't imagine how terrible I feel. Or like I just feel so terrible for older videos where I didn't edit that stuff out. It's like that's just that's how do you do it? Blame blame the they system. Get the Travis is there and they're like, all right, let's just go ahead and skip a minute and two ahead. He's still going. There was a, yeah, a bit of that when you do with some of your attacks. Some people also had it. Shinji had or uh Takashi had it for a couple of his abilities. To be fair, that was pretty common with all of us though i mean yeah. like blame the system you find you find ways around it like mike literally helped me go through like all my roles so i could have it in a little note area and now i use those all the time so yeah and now i have macros yeah <laughs> Sweet. progress just wait until star wars just wait until star wars wait. all right anyway it's unfortunate that our most popular series is the one that with like the least love, like TLC. Yeah. Martha. The worst audio quality the least edited at the time. Yeah. Everybody likes Naruto. Yeah, it's good. Yeah, that system though. <laughs> you don't like Naruto? I like that system. The D2 oh. system? Nah, I do love to... Uh... To, to any Genjutsu characters, especially like the strongest Genjutsu characters in the series. Uh, fun fact, episode one, 25,000 views. Nice. Episode two, nope. Yeah, in, so in two, to 6,000. All right, uh, anyway, uh, Ryzen, you're up. Here Again? Oh, cool. boy. Oh, boy. All right, well, I'm going to use... I'm going to go first hit. See, this is why I hit, hit my kids. Yep. Oh, on Daddy Awari. Twitch.tv slash Daddy Awari if you want to be hit by your father. BG. Jesus. <laughs> um, <laughs> I should have a dad gets the belt thing. When someone gets banned. Ooh, oh, I need to add. Belt. I need to add this to my, my stream note I, for a sound. In a... Uh, what's it? Uh, what's the... the I can't. I'm forgetting all the words. Uh, Billy Madison actor. Uh, Adam, Adam Sandler. Sandler? What, what's the movie he does where he's rich? Mr. Deeds. Mr. Deeds. I should have the sa uh, sound thing. It's like, no, daddy, no. No. <laughs> 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 all right. Uh, the 20 is a hit. All right. So that was to the, the guy right there. 
And I'm using water, uh. So. Blast. No, Daddy. No. No, 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 no Daddy. No. Daddy. You were disrespectful to a... I can't remember if he just says woman or something. You take it down. Nice. So... Is it still a D100 or... <coughs> yep. Like you're keeping up with how many, right? Uh, There were eight of them in here. Yeah. And the t- XP is 25. Right. So that's my and, turn. All right. And you've been grabbing your drops and everything accordingly? I do have the drops now listed in their tooltip. Uh, HP. Oh, I didn't do the money earlier. That's, <laughs> oh, yeah. I didn't that's why I'm just do... double checking so y'all know. I'm going to do my best to start doing that for every token now. Great idea. Plus one. I can just read. Yeah. All right, Michael. And five money, is that what it says? Yep. Yep. Water. Uh. Water. Oh, we get a plus do two you, bonus. Do you oh, think sweet. that that's like how magic was first discovered as stronger versions? Water. Uh, <laughs> GG. Hey. What's a good name for this? That's ability? it. Water. Uh, perfect. Which one are you hitting? Oh, the one yeah. in front of you? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, rip. Well. No, that's not typing. Right. Rippity doo da, rippity a. Let's my splash home, water my. on a robot today. I feel like I kind of want to. Oh no, that actually is sung by him, isn't it? Yeah, it is. All right, he takes sixteen points of damage. No. Anything else you're doing? Uh. Oh, oh, you also get the. Sorry, Reacts. yeah, because you are not rising. Reaction command, roll light check. You see 25. And Eight. you instantly take it down. All right. You see, you've sprayed it with it. your water, it is rusted, and it immediately just drops apart. All right. Uh, I guess can I, I'll, I'll heroic surge, and then... Dismantle them. They were the question. Did you do a full attack did. action? I said with a heroic. heroic well, yeah, but before, did you do a full attack action? No, I just did an attack. So why are you using a heroic surge? Oh, isn't it an attack? It's action. a swift action. No, oh, well, I'll use a swift action then. He immediately runs on over. And, so at the cost of one MP, you see that thing just immediately falls apart. <clears throat> you get the experience, but nothing else. My uh, D100 for the first one. What were you saying, Graham? Nothing. Oh, we go. I was saying we could have been doing this the whole time. <laughs> <laughs> Graham, you're up. <laughs> Full round. Uh, Three hits. Probably going to take it down. You take it down. All right. With those down, this guy goes up. He says, well, you all really good at what you do. We could use some of that if you all want to help us. Well, we're hoping we can help you by just sealing the keyhole. Are you aware of where that may be? Uh, no, I'm afraid I don't. Um, sounded like that guy might have. Maybe, uh, we should just chase after him? What do you think, uh, Big Weld? That's Big Weld, by the way. Yeah, nice to meet you, Big Weld. At that point, you see, he just starts rolling directly over the table, snapping it in two as he does going up. He says, I feel like dancing. What's wrong with you? The table was perfectly fine. <laughs> you all seem nice, and he goes up and he hugs you three. And you're now currently in his arms. Oh, can't leave out him? this one here. And he grabs Graham too. Oh, he's oh, already he's just, just, uh, and he starts walking up to <laughs> the glass window and just shatters through, hugging you all. At which point, uh, as you're falling, 
Rodney says, uh, something wants to have hit his head, one of those guard bots. Here, Lee climbs onto his head. Uh, help guide him, so that way we don't, so that way nothing happens. Uh, roll a pilot check. okay. Graham, roll a pilot <laughs> check. <laughs> All right. You feel as though you've got a pretty strong grip on this thing. Left. Give a second. Right. You see you fall off of the glass into a part of the building and it bounces off into a slide, at which point you are now going through the city. Dun, 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 so this thing is going to start moving automatically. <laughs> and if there is anything you guys want to do while this is happening, feel free to do it. Watch it. Can I jump on the ledge? Like, or is this... You see, this is now like two rails, like a marble, like when it has oh. those things where it goes down the two rails and it's sliding on it. That's what this is now. Gotcha. Um, get ready to cast up if something comes up. I'm ready to cast stop if something comes up. How do we get to the other side, though? I'm going to roll gravity. <laughs> You gotta roll gravity to hold it down or to. Oh, wait, gravity oh, wait. holds it up. Huh? He's Magna. Wait, yeah. we just use stop on him to make him stop moving? We could do either. Uh, and that? at what this is... point, you see it bounces off, crushes the chest that you're going over, and hops out of the next part of the, tr out of the track. F you, sir. All right. <laughs> <laughs> All right, let's, let's do stop first. If stop, I'm going to stop. Like gonna do stop. <laughs> All right, you cast stop, buying yourself a moment. All right, just go there. Yeah, it's one turn, so I'll just go and grab it and then run back. You hop off, you stand on the little ledge that you see just poking up. Roll 1d4. <laughs> yeah, it crushes it. All right. You, <laughs> now roll 1d12. Uh, shout out to that badge that we just missed. <laughs> Ooh. Ooh. Well, okay. 11 that is I got elixir dark haze Ooh. is that for everybody yep what yeah. is a dark haze is that a card yep yes yeah is that a magic one nope alright then you guys one of you guys can have it I'll take it if you don't mind yeah, yep it. sure since I think you have to roll a darkness check and we all know who has the best darkness check here <laughs> I have a darkness G -G. check that's decent it's probably better right. mine. Just for kicks, can we roll for that first one just to see what it was? What was that one? What were we going to roll? Oh, yeah, what it was, was a 1d10. Alright, let's just see for kicks. That would have been ether. Alright, cool. We I didn't miss, miss that. that. Yeah, alright, let's All right. go. You see your stop spell is worn off and is now going on again. Lean right! <laughs> Lean left! <laughs> <laughs> Anything you stop. doing? Yep, rolling stop. All right, now what you gonna do? Oh gosh! Wait, is it? Is it? What is that exactly? It's a chest, Travis. Yeah, I'm saying like, what is in between us and the chest? Obviously, uh, a gap falling down into the city. All right, and what's this? Uh, that, Another that part moment? of the track. And it's just hovering there, or it's... It's like there's something holding up that goes, goes all the way down to the ground. Uh, yeah, let's hop tracks, and then when we get here... How are we going to hop tracks? Magnet. This guy's going to say, what are you guys talking about? Just grab him and pull to the right and jump! Pull him up! Okay, let's do it. Let's see in a Disney uh, dude, we could just Disney like jump physics. across. Oh, let's do it. Yeah. All right. Okay. Uh, actually, sorry. Roll strength checks. Strength checks. Roll strength yep. checks. <coughs> you cut out. Sorry. Strength checks. Yeah. One, two, three. Plus friendship. Wow. How do I roll the least, and I have the best freaking strength check? That's just we all need to roll the strength because you don't yep. want me to roll mine. No, no, all of you. Do it. We Minus need five. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> roll the all perfect strength. twenty. 
Yeah, this is classic. You are able 20. to barely yeah, get on cool. to the that's next cool. track. All right, let's do it. Let's jump across. Um, all right. Well, stop. I'm going to use stop. All right. I'll, I'll, fuck it. I'll use it. Fuck it. I don't care. I'm going to hop over here and grab that. All right. Uh, roll 1d10. <coughs> Potion. Yeah, rest in peace. Actually, I do need one of those. Never mind. All right. Not Where are you going peace. now? Uh, let's jump it. Let's jump to this column right here, and then we'll ju- then go there. All right, so strength that's checks. Like, this one might be a little bit tougher. <laughs> I rolled mine preemptively. It was the six. So, okay. Uh, I think that's exact, uh, almost because exact. of your pilot check. I'm going to grant that to you. That's one less, I think. 16, 13. No, we you get are able more actually yeah. to land at the next area, and that pres- uh, continues to go on. Potion. Yeah, stop. Is that to me? Andy, or? I'll I'll use stop. Yeah, all right. Uh, sorry. Yeah, I thought <laughs> I was muted. <laughs> <laughs> all right. Who wants to? Who wants to get it? I'll do, I'll do it. That's why. No, go ahead. One D one hundred. Forty five. That is guard earring. Guardian ring. Guard earring. Guard earring. Oh. I haven't had one of those yet. I don't think. It's not great, but it's not terrible. That's an accessory, I assume. Yep. Yeah. All right, what you doing now? Oh, actually, you're right here. Yep. It really doesn't matter what you're going to do. Yeah, we'll try and check one more time just for the fun of it. Somebody say 20. Dang. Uh, Alright, Ryzen. Uh, nice. My hey. god. And you're all able Did to it. easily land on that. At which point, Rodney says, I've got it. And he snaps his head back on. He, you know, he kind of comes to. He's like, oh, what the, what's going on here? And then you all slam to the ground and knocking all of you off of him as it happens. But he continues to roll on into the distance. <laughs> Knocks into the same oh, big door. <laughs> Through a big door as he keeps on going. But. I get my MP back. Oh, what's the save point doing here? A save point, huh? I always thought this was just a weird bug causing that. Hey, here's a fun Star Wars fact for you. The voice actor for this guy, Obi-Wan. It is? Yeah. yeah, it actually See says McGregor. that on Ewan there. McGregor. It doesn't, say, it doesn't say Ian McGregor. It says Obi-Wan. Yeah. Oh, wow. <laughs> Obi-Wan. You know, oh, Ian McGregor has a brother, and he's a, he's a uh, pilot, yeah. and his pilot name is Obi-2. I love it. I love that so much. GG. So great. Yeah, he's like a pilot for the, like, the Royal Guard or something, right? Brit- British or some British Navy or something. <laughs> uh, British Air. Yeah. All right, and you all follow his path. Why do? Why are y'all over there? I'm... That's okay. You can jump back as you wish. Uh, but at the moment, I need to adjust your visions here. Be right back. Yeah. I assume those are like conveyor belts or like roads saying you can only go this direction. Yep, I'll be covering that here in just a second. So these are conveyor belts that you're on. You can freely hop between them as there makes sense to. There's no walls that are in your way here. You can all go to one side, you can go to both sides, you know. Um, However, if you're going the path of the conveyor belt, you have double your movement speed. But if you're going the opposite path, it's halved. Uh, That's convenient. Mm -hmm. Double or half. I'm up first, I guess. Yep. So you are good to go. Ryan's going to say, we need to go find Sitwell. Sitwell. We need to go find Big Weld. For whatever reason, in my mind, I've always known him as Sitwell. 
I was uh, well, this sucks. Roll well. Um, I s are these considered heartless? Or are they just bad robots? You see a group of there. small robots, smaller robots that have like they seem kind of run down, but they have some uh, saws and other aggressive tools with them. They're not heartless. Please. <clears throat> Um, okay, I'm gonna use water on it, I guess. All right. On the on the one right in front of me. What that? Actually, might be water, but it, you know, Watera feels right to me. Well, that's not. Uh, why the fuck was I going to Arden's fucking fucking listing? That would have been weird. Twenty-eight damage to it. Twenty-eight damage to it. Which one were you targeting? Oh. The hell. Uh, the one literally right in front of me. And with water, you said? Yep, Watera. Or water. You take it down. And that's my turn because I moved as well. All right. See, the other ones just like kind of growl at you and little robot noises. Shinji, you're up. Yeah. No. Okay. The chop shot bots. And those. Uh, so if movement is doubled. Does that mean flash step is also doubled? Because it's still 10 feet. Anything that would move you in that direction will also be doubled. Oh, heck yeah. Flash step. Attack this one. Alright. I hate going first in this. Yep. So, fun fact for you. Did you know, even though you can't see in that area, if you uh, hover your mouse over a spot and it has someone there, it'll tell you the reaction command stuff. <laughs> oh, you see the tooltip show up? Yeah. GG. Interesting. I guess it's because it's on the, uh, the token. Yeah. Interesting. Uh, that is a miss. There's no condition. Yeah, I figured that was a miss. There's probably no condition to be like, if, if target is visible uh, from lighting. <laughs> so Graham could just start moving his mouse around trying to see what's around those dang coders good well, thing I, was... I still have some things on the GM layer huh yeah GG. if I was if I was a bad <laughs> player I would do that <laughs> Graham you're up <clears throat> <laughs> yeah I just got a bit of line for you Alright, yeah. Stu Rake Raid. Stu Rake! Stu Rake! Stu Rake! I don't know why that just popped in my head. It's a good Naruto reference for y'all. Roll the damage. Those are all hits. RIP Jiraiya, am I right, guys? Except for the fact that you might be coming back in Boruto, according to a fan theory. So let's fucking not do that. Come on, guys. Come on. Three hours on that. Uh, apparently there's like some new enemy that has like a, a coffin or has some DNA of some old super powerful ninja and they haven't revealed who it is yet and people are theorizing of who it could be. Breathe in your mic, by the way, Mike. I'll be tell. That's some people are speculating that as well. In which case, fucking, what's the point of that? Like, oh, fucking Obito DNA. Ooh. Got a piece of shit while I'm here. Damn. <laughs> Wait, do uh, I get some business materials for those? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, okay, cool. Just making sure. Hmm. So there's four of them? Yep. All right. Now, it is the enemy's turn. All right. Those things are all going to attack Shinji. <clears throat> First one hits the guard. All right, that, that one hits the guard. Rip. There's some miss there. Alright. Counterattack. Uh, 20. That's it. Takes 17 points of damage. And now as the end of turn order happens, you see something else happens. I was wondering about that. 
All right. Ryzen, you're up. Uh, tittle dick. Um, GG. I'm going to use pretty much water, uh, water, uh, and then the finisher on the back one. <laughs> yeah, that wasn't because of you. That's just because I hadn't moved them. All right. That's a hit. That's I a hit. I was literally mapping out my next move. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> I was like, I was like oh, I'll do this. Never mind. Sorry. Hey, this is what it is. The first one, second one. You take those two out. Shinji. <clears throat> so, so with the uh, the negative combo boost or the negative combo thing. So, can I say like the second attack, or do I have to? Is your finisher? Plus, yeah, as my finisher. Uh, I think I do have like a weird Let listing in there. Um, so essentially what will happen with a negative combo is you can end after, as your second attack, you can have that be your finisher, but you will not get a third attack. Yeah, that's fine. My odds are lower anyway. <laughs> Actually, is that even That's it? a hit. All right, cool. These are little chump bots. The AC is much lower. Oh, that's definitely a miss. <laughs> yeah, that's a miss. It's him, right. though. We talked about this. You're doing good. <laughs> Man's hard to hit. Can't hit very hard, but he is hard to hit. GG. Yeah, there we go. Graham. So bring your mic a little bit. You. And I will do it again. I would do it. All right. <clears throat> I got just quietly to myself those are both hits I got real annoyed just about Ironwood again last night yeah. and I don't know why it came to my head I was just like motherfucker it's <laughs> kill all four of them trying to, try to sleep just like man <laughs> and Ironwood so Mike I've just killed four more by the way just to add to your counter thank you <clears throat> All right. Now it's their turn. These four are all going to move up on you, Graham. One, two, three, or one hit. All right. That's that to Shinji. That's a miss. All right. Eleven damage to you, Graham. <clears throat> Jokes on you. You just gave me one MP back. <laughs> <laughs> All right, Ryzen, you're up. Oh, sorry, sir. Whoa, what is happening? I was moving you forward. Oh, so where am I supposed to be? Because I was moving it too. Oh, uh, you are there. All right, I'm going to use water on it as well just going for one attack i mean i guess if this misses is that a hit uh that is a hit you kill it there's that for me and then i'm gonna move i'm gonna move up to shinji okie dokie Oakley, Oakley, neighborino. I'm robotic now, aren't I? Nah, nope, that was fine, actually. Okay, <laughs> interesting. Says I have a ping of 180. Nope. All right. Shinji. All right. 20. 40. Aha. See, so you have the path where it diverges. Staying on this path will lead it straight through, or you can hop off to another side. Go straight through. <clears throat> I got the I'll uh, only go 10 feet there. Okay, yeah. <clears throat> Enemies up ahead, Ryzen. Oh. 
So you end in there? Yeah, I ended there. Not like a 10 more movement left. <clears throat> oh, wait, we have double movement. Yeah, that's, that's what right. I'm saying. That would have been almost my full. That would have been your full movement yeah. speed right there. For the first attack. For the first movement. Be still an attack be, action. I guess it's still... Yeah. Oh, yeah. If that's the angle you're going, yeah. Yeah, that'd work. Then yeah. you have ten more. Nah, if it almost shoots water. I guess I should probably move up, so... Yeah. Water. <laughs> All right. Hit check. That's a hit. Right. Roll a light check. Right, let's do that. Probably won't matter if he dies. You hey. kill it. Uh, intern. Graham. Oh, full round attack. Uh, second hit's going to be Meg. Uh, sorry. Um, magnet burst. Third hit's going to be explosion. Explosion. All right. Uh, I think if I hit this one in front of me, it'll hit all of them. If I'm not correct. If yep. I'm correct, right? Okay. Yep. This first hit. <clears throat> Second hit. Third hit. Yep. You know, for for damage. I know you'll kill them. They all do. Okay. Especially since I've been rolling my damage wrong this whole time. Oh, <laughs> you've been rolling low. <laughs> Uh, I've been rolling. Um, if te theoretically, my damage it would normally be something like uh, I'm sorry, uh, it would be something like this. But on that second hit, since I'm using a finisher, it should be plus five, and on the third hit, it should be plus five more. I think. I think that's how that works. It should just apply. Which ability are you talking about? Uh, combo boost. <clears throat> It says two finishers. Okay, yeah, that's how that would work. So it'd be, since there's two finishers there, it would be the five for the first, and then the second one would be plus ten, right? Yep. So this whole time, I could have been rolling higher. Yes. <laughs> that's uh, Well, you've been having trouble. Rise, oh, sorry, enemies. You see they're running backwards. Sorry, the enemies are gone. And mm -hmm. now they end their turn, so now you all are moving up by the conveyor belt. Rising, you're up. <coughs> well then, well, um, I'll use water, I guess, on the one literally closest to me. Ooh, lucky, lucky. Is this black spot in the middle like a drop off? Yeah. All right. Making sure. All righty. So you get. One momento. Uh, it drops a lightning material. Ooh. Ooh. <clears throat> I just think it's kind well, of weird to the fact that I said they're not electric earlier. Just don't look into it. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> oh Mike, I, I killed four more by the way. Oh yeah, I got it. Look at how close those were. Look at how was... close. I know. Ninety five counts, doesn't it? No, nope. it's ninety six. Oh. Six to one hundred. Alright, Shinji. I think that still technically does not trigger. Okay. Correct. Alright. Well, if only I can do like water against all of them without using like heroic surge, but I'll just do vicinity break. Remember, that is also a drop off, so you or, could throw these enemies off, do things like that. Uh, That's also possibilities for y'all. All right, all right. Let's see what I got here. <laughs> or just. I don't want to give it to you. I'll say it afterwards. Use MP to like <laughs> dismantle. Well, I mean, you no, could do that as well, but totally. I have an opportune spot where I could like use a magnet or magnara or whatever and pull them all to one spot and they'd all fall in the hole. That may be the strategy I was going to say. Oh, sorry. That's no, fine. 
There's no, there's no sorry about that. I didn't want to reveal it because I, if you guys didn't think about it, I didn't want to say it. Guess I could do that, huh? I get the point. Do we get the XP? Well, not the XP, but the uh, that's right. I guess we kill them. So sure, why not? Straight. No, where are you casting? Save, so. <laughs> uh, what's the I think thing. thing it. Dude from right here. All right. You cast it. You see they all get yanked in, screaming as it happens. Yeah, yeah, they're trying to like grab you, trying to grab onto the conveyor belt for their dear life. And they all fall off. You get full drops. What a great episode for Connor to sound robotic. I know. <laughs> of all the ones. Well, I'm sorry that I do sound robotic. I'm you definitely going to have to pull from your... my audio, yeah. I was going to say, you right. won't from your audio, though. So. <clears throat> and you all sound fine to me. So we still get to we still get all the stuff. Yep. Like drops and everything. Yep. Oh shit! I'm gonna do that then. All right, Graham, you're up. Yep. Yeah, I'm gonna do that. Like <clears throat> just right here. And it'll get all of them right. Yeah. Yeah. Well. They'll scream again, so, begging for dear life. Eight D one hundred. I got I got two. You got two. That's two Latin materials. And then um, I'm going to run over here and open this one and then run back over here and open this one. All right. The first one you get is a Keyblade. You get the Keyblade Shining Parts. You see, it's made up of a lot of just like kind of different, like almost taped together uh, robot parts. It's very makeshift, things like that. Um, and it grants you uh, eight damage and one MP. Just eight damage? Eight damage and one MP. Oh, okay. I didn't hear that perk is cut out. Sorry. I'm trying. <laughs> Sorry. I'll give that to... Most likely going to get out to Shinji. And then I'll open this one too. 1d4? Yeah. 1d12. Fire that. Oh, sorry. Blizzard Edge. Alright, everybody gets that one. <clears throat> I have three of those now. What is it? Blizzard Edge. Is that a it's card a as well? Yes. Yep. Magic card. Wait. Keyblade card. Blade card. Sorry. Oh, you can have mine. You're not next to it. Yeah, it's fine. Alright, Ryzen, you're up. Oh, Shinji, why won't you move? It's not my turn yet. <laughs> it's when Ron uh, comes out no don't move oh, sorry it's Harry does that we're still in the I'm gonna game use, I'm going to use magnet right here alright hoping to pull in from this other one too blah, 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 blah. how I'm many was that multi I'm just going to give multi you 12 there have been like one that was out of that range I'm just going to give it to you wow 12 synth 12 synthesis materials and only a collective 500. Ooh. All right, well, that's my turn. Shinji. You also see this part where, like, your vision's cut off. There's just, like, some weird box that's there. Oh, okay. Like, going up to this guy? Or, no, I didn't. Just a box. I'm just a little box. After. Yeah, I'm going to open this up. First. All right. 1d4. Oh, wait, no. Sorry, that was supposed to be something else. 12. I'll give it. I'll just give them both to you. I already had your rolled 1d4. Roll 1d10. Yes. 1d8. 1d8. Jesus Christ. <laughs> uh, deep freeze. Deep freeze. You also find something else. Another deep freeze. You find Reflera. Ooh. What is Reflera? Reflect uh, stage 2 of Reflect, oh. yeah. Essentially more damage. Heroes. Mm -hmm. And I'm going to try and jump on this box. Yo, what right. the... <laughs> Alright, you're not supposed to be, uh, have that weird vision <laughs> there. We're going to say you land like right there as though you're on top of it. 
You can see it looks as though it's something that is supposed to mesh the pieces together, but it's broken. Uh, I will pick that up. It's like a broken puzzle box. It's too big for you to just pick up. No. Can I try and solve it then? Yeah. Are there or pieces missing? To repair it, you can. All right. Uh, well, you want, I'll, I'll try it, and then I'll say, uh, you want to try this <clears> next? <throat> Rise it, my dear friend. That is close, but no cigar. Not late. Graham. Huh? Muted life. Muted life. <laughs> My path has split. Once again. Yeah, you see, there's one track going up here that's going up and one coming back towards you. And I'm in the <clears> middle <throat> and I move my full 60. Yeah. Let's take care of these guys. I can take care of... Would that be three or four? Oh, uh, if you're using that, yeah. That'd be a uh, three. Um, I, I figured you'd just use magnet again. It costs two, though. Don't you have? Yeah, you have three. <laughs> yeah, I guess it call. does cost two MP. Uh, I, guess, I guess so. I'll do that. <laughs> All right. Resin, you're up. That's eight more, Shinji. Alright. Ryzen, what you doing? Return the slab. I'm going to Return what, what, the slab. What is the difference? You're gonna ignore yeah. Shinji's call out? Oh, well. Yeah, no, not. Can I <laughs> jump across? Yep. He said, hey, repair this. I roll 20 just froze. What the fuck? There we go. So can I do it from there or do I have to jump across? You have to jump across. Do you need me to roll anything? Oh, for the jump, no. You're close enough oh. with that. Alright, uh, roll a repair. Imagine if I just like roll pulled a Resident roll. Evil on this and there's like a bomb inside of it and just blew up when you repaired it. How much okay. would a dick move would that be? <laughs> Almost Ryzen, you are able to repair it, and you see the puzzle box completes oh. itself at that point. Oh, I'm opening it. You get the repair badge. Hey. Almost called it the reparations what? badge. That's what I was saying earlier. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, that's... A, that's not what that word means, and B, let's not go political yeah. here. <laughs> All right, you still have uh, more movement you can do if you wish. Yeah, yeah. Like, still have ten yeah, more on I'm this uh, movement, and then you still have your full other one. Jump back, and then move up to here. All right, and you see you've end arrived at the end of the conveyor belt. <laughs> hmm. Hey Shinji, I found the end of the conveyor belt. And Shinji, you're up. No way. We did it. Deep breathing exercises. Graham, you're up. You see Big Weld currently in the air. He's got a magnet holding him up there. And you also see the silhouette of something else. Pure darkness. Just for the sake of this, you all move together towards the center. Oh, okay. I can move to them. It's fine. You see a face <laughs> that you know from one of the silhouettes. Oh, no. Steps forward. Hello there. 
uh, hi. Or the clanky one. Clanky? Watch your language when you talk to your elders. You're not my elder. No, you're definitely yes, old. I am. How old are you? That's not a question you ask a lady. You're a lady? Oh, I'm sorry. You're not a lady. You're a robot. She glares at you all. Keyblade wielders, I am Madam Gasket. You may know me from the former Guardians of Evil. Wait, former? Are you Ratchet's mom? Yes. How's he doing? Does he look well? Look like he's eating enough? Eating enough? I mean, he he's never shined more. <laughs> yeah, that's very good to hear. And uh, yes, former. Sorry, I didn't hear you. She said, and yes, former. Not anymore? No. There you can relax. That group disbanded after you all took out the doctor. You proved yourselves not to be just worthy foes, but superior. So the last two members, me, the mas- me and the masked man, and I guess there's also Arden if you want to count him, which I don't, we decided to break apart. Oh, I'm sorry about your breakup. It's not like it was a couple, don't worry. <laughs> so I'm no longer your enemy. As you may have seen, I have many of the robots that my son looks over take care of the city at the moment, slaying the heartless. And if you wish to seal the keyhole, I will even tell you where it is. What are you going to do with Big Weld? That's none of your concern, Keyblade Wielder. Shouldn't you be a good warrior of light and not get involved in the affairs of other worlds? It is true. <laughs> so I am offering you the keyhole in exchange for separating for yourself from the situation. As a Keyblade Wielder, it's our duty to seal the keyhole. But as a warrior of light... It's our job to stop you. Does he speak oh, for all of you? Oh, oh. You bet. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> mother! Oh, oh, I'm here. Oh, oh mother, so those keyblade... He looks at you. <clears throat> Go on. So we met your mom. Yeah, she's, um... Isn't she a sight? You must take after your father? Yes. All right, we're not getting into that here. <laughs> Are you sure this is your decision? I'm like, I'm trying to offer you a deal. No, thanks. And I believe it is more than fair. We'll find the keyhole without you. Hmm. <laughs> If that's what you choose, so be it. She readies yourself for combat. All right. Ryzen, you're up. This is a masterpiece. My turn first, huh? Yep, as always. All right, well, I'm going to do... Uh... Oh, I'm going to use Blizzard, looking at the tooltip. Would I know that, though? Yeah, exactly. Oh, yes. Oh, yeah, right. But keep in mind, okay. you can't use that. It's reaction. I can't use Blizzard? You can't use the reaction command. Chill out. Well, well, that's fine, but I I can tell that Blizzard hurts her mower. That's not that's, that's not necessarily what that's saying. Oh uh, well, then I'm gonna go back. I'm gonna do the water stuff. So, so there's first hit, <clears throat> second hit, third hit. You see, there's a fire coming out of her head, and all of the water evaporates upon contact with her. Yeah. Dope. This is gonna be uh, annoying. 
Right, well, that's guys. my turn. Shinji. <coughs> Run up and use Blizzard. All right. Hit check. I can land this hit check. That is a miss. Well, flies on by right past her. She just smiles. What were you aiming for? Definitely not me. The big orange back here, by the way, that's just like an open furnace that's burning. All right. Well, uh, may as well e blade form on up and try to trigger this attack of opportunity. Okay. Which she will take. That's a miss. Yeah, miss. All right. Graham. Sliding dash into Ars <laughs> Arcanum. Um, I want the... So can I do the last two hits on uh, my back part to be the same thing? Blitz and Blitz? Or does that have to be two different things? You can't do Blitz and Ars Arcanum. You've let me do it before. Have I? Yes. You let me do... I went all the way through and at the end of it, the very end, I'd use Blitz. It was a finisher. I can understand okay, if yeah. you don't want me to do it because yeah, now, now could... you're good. Now you're good. So do I? Can I use it twice or just once? Oh, uh, you can only use it once. They have to be different. Okay. Then I will do that. I do specify that two different finishing moves. Okay. Where's that first roll? The plus twenty-three. Three, four, five, six hits. Um, is the twenty-one a hit? Nope. Okay, let's. So the finishers do not make a difference here. All right, so six hits then. <clears throat> but I did get a crit. Yep. Here we go. Thirty-four. 35, 64, 35, 31, 34. All right. Now it's her turn. Can She's I do, gonna... um, can I do a heroic surge and, um, go into, uh, drive form? Oh uh, yeah. I will do that. All right. Roll 1d20. Oh, yeah. Yep, going <clears throat> Valor. Good, 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 good. And all right, so the first thing she does, she snaps her fingers, and you see... Four of these guys drop in. Oh, I don't have the stats appropriately there. It's not what I meant to do. <clears throat> no one saw that. <laughs> that would have been fun. So you see four of them drop in. And then she says, overheat. Let's see what those keyblades do for you now. You would see she unleashes a wave of molten hot fire through the battlefield. So as for each of you that are wearing or that are uh, holding keyblades, you will take 1d8 plus 3 damage to start off with. Graham, you are holding 2, so you're going to take this twice for damage. So you're going to take that twice. Now each of you need to roll a fortitude save. Graham, you need to roll 2. <laughs> Mm. 
need to pass. Uh, so your first one passes, Graham. Your second doesn't. Uh, Ryzen, you and Graham, the heat from that keyblade is too intense, so you drop it, and you're currently unable to hold it until the start of your, or until the end of your next turn. Okay. Yeah, please it back. Um, should I apply this? I didn't think about this when I first did this as well. <clears throat> How would you argue the metal for your transformation works? Is it a part of you, or is it just an illusion? I'd say it's an illusion. Oh, you mean for the? Magic? I would say it's an illusion, but let me think to what they because it's magic. Past. No, it's a part of you. Because that's yeah, why they're it? able to breathe underwater. And the fish tail and shit, yeah. Yes. So you're going to take additional uh, damage from this as well. I don't allow it. <laughs> you each take 39 damage as well. Oh my god. <clears throat> uh, but bright side, that's all she can do this turn. Now this guy, Ratchet, he's going to also do some stuff. Shinji, I'm waiting for that health to drop. I negated that. That was true damage. The 39 damage? The 30 damage? No. 39 damage? Uh, for some reason, it didn't scroll down, so I didn't see that. This man thing I was just talking about, a 4. If you negated yeah, 40 right. damage, I, I'm, I'm going to have to go and retcon some stuff. <laughs> negated all that. All right, uh... All right, Ratchet's going to go up. He's going to try and punch you, uh, Shinji. <coughs> is that a hit? Uh, that is currently a hit, yeah. Oh, wait. He, he hits you for 13 yeah, damage. It is just a hit, yeah. You also don't have the bonus from your Keyblade form at the moment, so that's also part of this. Oh, no, no, you passed your check. Never mind, never mind, you're fine. But, so fire, three, so that's four. Ryzen, you're up. So, do I have to spend an action to uh, pick up my Keyblade? You are currently unable to pick it up until the end of your turn. But I can't, so I can't use magic then. Unless you say grab something around that might be like a metal pipe on the ground and cast magic with that. Well, I'm just gonna use a uh, Dark Faraga magic card. Okay. I accidentally closed the book. Does someone have that in front of them? I will in just a moment. I do. You don't. Uh, all right. You launch a ball of darkness at your enemy, dealing 8d10 damage to all hit and adjacent targets. How much damage? 8d10. Plus but my intelligence? or <laughs> Nope. Okay. Just a flat 8d10. Nope. <clears throat> Rip. I don't know how to subtract 8d10 from three or from these numbers. All right, so they both take 55 damage. Ryzen, roll a darkness check. I was going to do something here since this is reacting a little bit slow. You succeed, you are not stunned. Shinji, you're up. Exactly what I was looking for. All right, uh, gonna try to use Blizzard again. Uh, wherever that roll was at. That is a mess. Hero Surge. That is a mess. That's real unfortunate, Shinji. It really is. One more time. That is a hit. Barely. Yes. I mean, I'll take what I can get. <laughs> I guess I could use like Blizzard Edge or some trash. Nah, it's too late for that. Uh, he's in damage. <laughs> I would have had a better chance with that. And don't forget to roll your light check as well. <clears throat> uh, yes. 
What the? You barely, barely succeed that you check. Going in, really, I was like, <laughs> she is currently unable to use either of her two heat-based attacks. Alright. I'm also going to use Erosa. And walk up. All right, Graham, you're up. All right, I'll do a full round action. Attack action, I mean. Yep. So you're doing this with Valorform's abilities, but only with one hit per, uh, you know, not the two hits like you typically would. Yep. Did you have a macro for the two hits? I did. It's kind of annoying now, huh? Just a little. <laughs> Didn't see that kid. I was, I'm still that. trying to add unique abilities, you know? Unique effects. <laughs> keep you on your toes. I think this does that. So those last Shake two, those last two, I can't yep, remember. Those last two double. will be hits. If they're double or triple, I can't remember. <laughs> it's been a minute since I've looked at that. Uh, for Valiform, it should be triple. Yeah, last two hits are going to be triple damage. Let's so see. I'll verify that. That's a, that's a crit, normal hit, and two triples. Your last attack. Oh, no, it's just going to be one hit. I'm sorry. Yuck. Your last attack will be uh, triple damage. Yeah. I was gonna. I was thinking about that. I was like, because this only has one, and you're only allowed to use one type of finisher at the end, so you can't stack finishing plus. Yeah. Yeah, no, yeah, no I, I, for some reason, I was thinking because I was in Valor form, I was hitting two times, <clears> but it's, yeah, it's not. So it, it's still one, uh, two, three, four hits, one crit, and a finisher. Yep. So who knows? This might be it. At least for her. One D eight plus thirty. There's the crit, and then there's the normal hit, and then there's the other normal hit. And then there's there Man, you there's get the, complicated. I just I just point and shoot. There's the triple. GG. Plus forty five. GG. Yes. I've been missing out on this the whole time. Plus five <laughs> per hit yeah, prior. Yep. Yes. Keep in mind for the sake of Ooh. future, Ars Arcanum does reset that counter. Cool. Because it That's traces fine. as though it's a full new attack action, a full new combo. So it resets That's... that counter. Okay, so now, cool, cool. just so you know, for the future. Still OP. Yeah, it's still real strong. So that's uh, 51. That's uh, 100... 153. 53. You can see that she has been cut up. Part of her metal body's falling off, but she's still going. Ah, son, please help me. So, the, would you say it's mother. like... Oh, I don't know if he lagged or I lagged. Nah, he, he lagged. It's probably okay. Can't well, I didn't mean to cut you off. Um, am I? Can I tell? Like parts are really dangling. Like in theory, if I were to use magnet, would pieces of her like break off, or would potentially all of her technically? But it's her turn first, so you know we'll we'll, we'll get there. We'll get there. <sighs> Graham just hit her for a lot. She's going to use Dismantle on Graham. Mm -hmm. So okay. she does a she highly damaging Rosa. move, but it's at a penalty. Oh, right, a Rosa. Yep. Well, was that a been that would that wouldn't have even been a hit, huh? <laughs> nope. I got twenty three right now. Yep. Well, just for the Damn. fun, this is what the damage would have been. <laughs> Yikes. Alright. You still wouldn't even you still wouldn't have even uh, triggered your one hit point move. Nope. All right, uh, this guy, he's gonna run Watch around here. He's gonna try and tackle Graham. <laughs> Double dang. He ain't gonna let you touch. At which point you just evade out of the way and he just misses to the other side. Uh, uh, gotta pick himself up. All right, so hear me out. And he just starts running. 
He got he got past I, Shinji's because of uh, the situation, I, but. And I picked up my other keyblade at the end of my turn, so I hit him twice, right? You didn't clarify it. But you said I picked it up at the end. You said you can't pick it up at the end. All right. Ooh. <laughs> I know it's a technicality. I'm just trying to, you know. I'm Get just trying to give them a fighting first. chance. Yeah, that's it. Drops down 34 hit points. Keeps on running. All right, Ryzen, now you're up. Killing you on my next turn. <laughs> GG. Now someone seems angry. Gosh. All right, Ryzen, what you doing? <laughs> does the, does, when I say that, does the triangle like oh. in front of me? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you see the silhouette of that triangle. I can help you I'm with that. I'm gonna use magnet. I can make right sure he here. never comes back. What is the what is the distance for magnet? Let me see. Twenty. Twenty feet. So I'm gonna use magnet right here. Alrighty. You see parts of her metal comes off. Uh however he is unaffected by it. Actually, all of this treated with the same way his uh, other stuff is, which hasn't triggered yet. Roll a 1d20. Uh, d20. When did this guy be pulled into? <clears throat> That's what I was saying. Based on the way that this guy's stuff works. That's gay. That's what I was trying to do. Ooh, that is... That is unfortunate. Yeah, they'll pull him in as well. They slam into each other. What you doing? Do I need to? So, well, so that's one hit. Technically, like, with hit two and three, am, am I... Able, well, does magnet count as a hit? Magnet cannot be used in part of a combo. Well, so, okay, hit so two that was and just three, a, You just used do. an attack action, yeah. Okay, so then I'm gonna... I'm going to... I'm going to stay put. I, I can't think of... Shinji, you're up. What else I would do right now? I was drift. you had Heroic Surge or something? I don't. Okay. Everything good, Graham? Uh, yeah, I just need to make a phone call. Cool. But you just didn't, did. They didn't answer, so... Okay. They'll probably call me back right at the most unopportune time. Well, Shinji, what you doing? Limit four. I thought you said lemon for a second. It took me a second to realize. <laughs> What's a limit form? It's a lemon yes. form. He's about to go have a lemon party. Yes. Ooh. <laughs> mean, does he mean drive form? <laughs> yep, there it is. How fucked up would that be? Like, if in, like, your drive form in the game and in this, that, like, you had to roll a check to make sure you didn't get, like, a piece of shit car used car salesman? <laughs> this every now and then anyway. your armor just starts falling apart it's like no the mileage said it'd be good for this GG so what you doing Shinji anything else yes I had to look for the name of the uh, the move the sonic reef ah. I'll get last arc and I'm this. I not even remember that I, I can't even remember the last time I actually went to limit for yeah, limit form is the most debatably useful one of them all. Just like in real, just like in the real game. One, two, three. That'll work, right? Uh, yep. And remember, you can hit them all twice, so you can go back through. Now we'll do that then. I mean, if that actually hits. Uh, first one's a miss, second one's a hit, third one's a miss, fourth one's a miss. Third one's against that one. If that makes a difference. I don't remember the AC. Uh, it was just the second one was the hit, so just on that guy. Okay. There we go. 
He takes 16 points of damage. Would have been great. Unfortunately, these guys are literally made of metal, so I gave them slightly higher than above uh, average ACs. Nah, that's fine. <laughs> And uh, it's my turn. Graham. Attack. That's 3 MP. I'm actually out of that form, aren't I? I think I am out of drop form. I think that's Yes, turns. you are. So it doesn't matter anyway. Go to pick up my Keyblade. It's, it's not there. Oh, yeah. Shit. Disappears. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Well, you know, this has been fun and real. Uh, but, you know, things come to an end. A sliding dash... Hit the seventh uh, there and just didn't do it. It was like to troll you, to troll me. Sliding dash. Um, <coughs> and we're going to do a full round attack with Ars Arcanum just to make sure she dies. All right, fair enough. <coughs> One, two, there. three, four hits. Yeah, she's going to go down. And then uh, I will do a uh, heroic surge, and I will do a strike grade on him. All right, roll them hits. Which, which I did the math right. I think I had three. Yeah, I had so that would put me at zero MP. There's the hits. I'm guessing both those are hits, and the second one's a crit, so he's probably going down as well. Roll the second one. Oh, there it is. All right, you see, she drops down, and he is slammed back with that one. Oh, God. Please, please, First uncle, I give up. I'm just here to run a company. And she's, Ugh, you keyblade brat. I completely forgot to date, take these guys' turns. Well, I, I, assume that the, I, I assume that uh, when Ryzen did that attack, it killed them. With the Keyblade card? Sure. Yeah, that's what we'll say happened. I just forgot to remove them. I just genuinely wasn't <laughs> thinking. Roll a 4D100. <laughs> All right. Well, yeah, Dale. Why not? why not? I mean, I guess I'll just add that experience on me. Why not? So she starts panting. <laughs> you brats really don't know when to give up, do you? You could have gave up at any time. <laughs> Some of us have dreams. Things that must be accomplished. I'd argue so do we. <laughs> the more you interfere with the world, the more damage you cause, you know? Oh, the more darkness you spread, the more often we'll appear. I was trying to help you seal the darkness away and move on from it. You chose to do this. Tell me where the keyblade hole or the keyblade hole is and I won't kill your son. <laughs> I don't think you have the guts to do that. Mom? Mommy? Can I roll a darkness can I roll a darkness check to see like to have it like start cooling off me a little bit? Yeah. <laughs> Alright, I have to end game like perception check this then. <laughs> yep. Well if this happens, I am do I need to roll a perception for that? Yeah, you can both roll perception. I will if that's <laughs> not enough, I will roll a I will roll a, a freaking spirit enough. die. I'll say okay. it's I don't see it. Shinji, I'll say you see it. Ryzen, you're too far back. You're like the the heat of or the fire and the incinerator behind is like causing a mess up so Ryzen you don't see it. And she kind of changes her tune at that. Goes, all right, all right. I forgot you are one of those ones. Fitting that you're the one to bring my life to an end. Then. No one said your life is ending today. <laughs> I don't think you know how this works. The other organization works now. Where is it? It's my incinerator itself. All right, go with peace. Go with peace. Am I fucking go drinking? Go in peace. <laughs> oh, wait, she's oh, a she's... four piece. Oh, wait, I, I got a better one. I got a, a better one because she's machine parts. Go in pieces. Get out. Edit that out. <laughs> <laughs> Just take two. 
Oh my god, we gotta get Mike one of those though. Like a just like just for now on, that's gonna be his thing. Take two. <laughs> All right, y'all. Let's Trinity Trinity limit uh, Keyblade lighter. Done. In a triangle formation. Let's be symmetrical here. Uh, uh, oh, where she's going? She's showing us where it is. She see she's going up to a little panel on the side of the wall. It says, "Here, I'll close the incinerator and get the key blade, the keyhole for you." When she goes to click a few buttons, then you see suddenly the magnet holding this guy starts moving him rapidly towards the incinerator. Wait, I don't have I don't have an MP. Someone stop it. I'm gonna use. Do I have enough MP? Nope, I don't either. I don't know. I do. All right, so you're going to do it? I guess technically I would have after taking that damage. So yes, I will use Magnet. Magnet. All right, you are currently fighting the Magnet. Ryzen? Anything? Help me. Simba. Um, what do you want me to do, Mike? Yeah, save him. <laughs> I don't necessarily know how. Um, you could either try and knock him down. You could try and stop her. Uh, or yeah, I'm gonna use water on the, the on the. Uh, I'm gonna use water on the mom running away. What, Graham? You see that the water hits her and it turns to steam and does nothing. Again, oh, right. Right, 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 right. right. Said it. You know what? No, I'm gonna. What He's trying to like do? knock her back or use a magnet. Yeah, I'm gonna try and use a magnet and 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 pull and yeah, that's what I'm gonna do. Jesus, forgot about that. They're like I mean, eight solutions to die. this problem, by the way, and that's the one that. <laughs> Yeah, in, in your defense, I did use use Blizzard earlier to, to stop that momentarily. <laughs> All right, with the two magnets combined, you're able to rip him free from that and rip her away from the panel. Does she start dissipating at this point? No. If she doesn't, she's going to in a minute. No, she's still there. <laughs> ah, yeah, you brats. Let me take care of this and secure a future for my son. Nah. She's gonna run around, and start trying to push him. Secure future for your son. Um, May not be the one you want. Uh, no. Y'all gonna stop it? All right, cool. Yes. So I'm gonna walk up now, <laughs> and I'm gonna shove my keyblade through her back. Oh, All right. That, yes, I'm stopping it. Oh. Well, I, well, he he was there before anyone else could, and he was already took the first action. I'm gonna grant it to him. You do that, and you see she uh, uh, she so falls. What are you doing, Grim? She's gonna kill an innocent life. That's done. You didn't have to kill her. You, tell me if you want to. She's gonna continue to do it. Mom. He starts running around to her. No. Your mother was evil. I'm sorry. You so say was he. she took care of me when no one else did. She was there for me. She helped me run a company, the best, pro most profitable company in the world, thanks to me and her guidance. Well, now you'll either be, what she did was right. Now you'll be sitting in jail, rotting. That's what you think. He's gonna run up and kick Sitwell. Big world. I keep saying Sitwell. Fuck. Uh, attempt to stop. That's a strength check. He runs up and slams it. It just moves a few feet in that direction. Right, I'm Rise, like, Rise, can you shut the, the door, please? They're tackling to the ground. Yeah, can, you <laughs> shut the, can you shut the incinerator? This is getting old. Uh, yeah, that's fine. You got to be... Uh, roll computer use. Oh, man. Uh-oh. <laughs> Lava floods out. 
<laughs> kill, kill, kill him. Thank God. I hope that's okay. <laughs> you see, the first few seconds, you kind of stumble around accidentally. Uh, but then you see the door slam shut. And there you see a keyhole engraved on the door. Hey, there it is. Oh, thank you, guys. Thank you for uh, helping take care of all this. Sorry, it's a shame that she had to go down for it, but I'll make sure that Ratchet here suffers the consequences for his actions. Cause yeah, guys, seriously, thank you so much for everything you've done. Really, you really didn't need me there at all, did you? Could have used my ability so many more times, but uh, you just didn't want to use it. She used it one more time and bring her back to life. No, no, let's disassemble the big guy. So, uh, you kind of destroyed her. You just shoved a knife through her back. Yeah, Where's and the parts there are kind of destroyed now. You can't get better parts? I mean, we what could. About- Thanks to Big World here, we definitely could. The issue is that too much of her has now been destroyed. That is done. I can't say I agree with it, but you saved more lives here. That much is true. Let's take him into custody. Listen, you can leave that to me. I'm going to steal a keyhole. Where is that keyhole? See, it's on the door. That's right there. I paid $40 for the prop. (laughs) It would have been great. You You definitely would have gotten a spirit tie for it. It was for every it. time. Every time it happens. Spirit die. You mean no, seven you more times? Back. Potentially. You, you can still Possibly far less. That you know, not every one of those episodes is gonna have the keyhole. And you all seal, unseal, and reseal the keyhole. <clears throat> Alright, well thank you for everything. We've got it from here. Alright. And you all <laughs> Go back to your gummy ship. No, it's annoying. Huh. We're nearing the end of the session, clearly. And roll 20 is now not being laggy. Tragic. That's about right. Mm -hmm. Connor's not laggy either anymore. Sometimes that's just life. hell is that is that a star destroyer sorry something's hey. happened here that i meant to i didn't i didn't prep a token for you all fly off of the ship or fly off of the city with your ship you arrive in the world or in the universe out above and immediately you see that there's a big ship right above you good job Razen. good call graham you realize your controls have been taken from you as you've been caught in some sort of a tractor beam. What is this? Some kind of tractor beam? <laughs> and you're ta- you're taken aboard the ship. The hell's going- and that's where we're going <laughs> to end things. <laughs> oh, hey, uh, do I need to roll for the mom and the son? For what? Uh, I killed them. Yeah. What would you roll? I don't know, 1d20 or... No, you, you've just gotten darker. You oh. have to roll, I think, for that. <laughs> oh, okay. Um, <laughs> no, I mean... <laughs> I mean like, um, lumen. This materials. Oh. I thought you meant for the murder you committed, not just for winning <gasps> the battle. It was a robot, let's be honest. Uh, so <laughs> she dropped 250 money and 600 experience. Uh, he dropped 50 money and 50 experience. And you can roll a 1d20 for Gasket. <coughs> Nothing for him. Synthesis material. So hey, thanks for watching everybody. We'll see you next time. Well, thank you for watching. Remember to hit that like button, subscribe, and ring that bell for notifications if you like this. If you're looking to support us, be sure to check the description below for a link to our merch store and Patreon you can check out. Speaking of which, I'd like to give a special thank you to this month's patrons. Alright, thanks for watching. We'll see you next time.